The recent PlayStation 5 price hike has caused Final Fantasy XVI to trend on Twitter in Japan, as fans express concern that they won't be able to play the game since they can no longer afford the PS5. Sony announced a PS5 price increase on August 25th, with the cost of both the digital and physical editions of the console increasing in most regions, save for the United States of America. The PS5 price increase was effective immediately in most regions, but not in Japan. The PlayStation blog mentioned that the PS5 price increase won't come into effect in Japan until September 15, so there is still some time for Japanese fans to nab one at the old price. The new price for the digital PS5 in Japan is 49,478 yen, while the physical PS5 is 60,478 yen, which translates to $360 and $440 respectively. The current price of the PS5 systems in Japan is 43,978 yen for the digital model and 54,978 yen for the physical model, which translates to $320 and $400 respectively. The short wait until the PS5 price hike kicks in won't be any good to the Final Fantasy fans of the world, as 16 francs is launching in summer 2023. This has prompted fans in Japan to take to Twitter to address their concerns. According to Atakemachi on Twitter, 16 francs trended on Twitter in Japan thanks to all of these complaints regarding the PS5 price increase, as well as the fact that PS5s are still incredibly difficult to acquire in the region. Japanese Final Fantasy fans are worried about the PS5 price hike 16 francs is currently being advertised as a PS5 exclusive, and the fact that it's launching in 2023 means that this might stick. It's not uncommon for games originally pegged as current-gen exclusives to receive last-gen ports if the old systems still have a big fanbase. In the case of the PS5, there are lots of people who can't get their hands on the system, and the PS5's higher price point also means that people might not be able to afford a console even if they can get their hands on one. Tears still hope for 16 francs, as fans are asking Square Enix for a PC port of the game. This seems like something that would have happened anyway, as the PC is a huge platform for Final Fantasy games, and it's only natural that the next mainline entry would end up there. The problem is that Sony likely inked a timed exclusivity deal with Square Enix, and 16 francs will likely stay on the PS5 for at least a year. This is the same reason why it took so long for 7 Frank Remake to arrive on PC. Final Fantasy XVI should arrive on PC eventually, but fans will be waiting a while without the means to play the game on other platforms. Source, Atakemachi Twitter.